The U.S. Census predicts that over half America's population will be people of color in 2044. With this increase of diversity in schools, educating students and teachers on diversity will become more and more important. This work is at the top of their priority list, so everyone is very happy that it's taking place. For the most part, everyone like is aiming for the same goal, which is like um, like equal opportunities for students and just like fairness. When a school community is a safe and supportive environment, students will grow academically and socially. I mean, we come from different backgrounds, different cultures, so we kind of see things in some like different ways, and we also have some similarities. I just think it also just gives them a different perspective if they know people who have different backgrounds from themselves. Um, they'll just be able to understand other people, other cultures, and be more kind. Encouraging diversity in schools is not always easy, but the more diversity is talked about in school, the less students and teachers will hesitate to address it. I think overall it opens up for like kind of a uncomfortable situation, but it's a really good learning experience for all. Looking at material or books that you're reading, anything you're doing, it should have windows and mirrors in it. So anyone that's reading it should be able to look out a window and see a different perspective. And they should also be able to read something and see themselves in it. So the mirror is seeing yourself so you can identify and connect with it. And the windows is so you have the opportunity to open up and learn about others. Change doesn't happen overnight, but the most important step is getting started. I'm Lori McLean from Cromwell High School reporting for Fox 61 Student News.